Good day all, I'm an RF engineer at Point in Peter Prince. And I'm a mechanical engineer student, Cameron. Today we will be showing you how you can make your very own 4 dBi helium antenna in order to improve your average beacons per day and your total Whitmer score. We will do this by showing you how you can make your very own gyropole antenna. A gyropole antenna is an antenna that consists of an array of radiating dipole antennas that is seriously fed with a phase network and a matching network. This here is a complete JPL antenna. These two sections here is your radiating elements. This is your phase matching network and this is your matching network. We will be making both JPL antennas for the US 950 MHz LoRa band and the EU 868 MHz LoRa band. In order to complete this project, you will need one meter of single core 2.5 millimeter electrical wire that you can find at your local hardware store, three meters of RG58 with one RPSMA connector that you can get at any ele electronic shop. You will also be needing a soldering iron, solder, flux, one long nose plier, and one side cutter. First thing you'll need to do is measure out your wire. The first section will be half of a wavelength. Now take your long nose pliers and bend where you've marked 90 degrees. like so. The next measurement is a quarter of wavelength. Bend this once again 90 degrees. Now take your pliers and bend it again 90 degrees backwards a random small amount. It shouldn't be too big. It should look something like this. Now measure out another quarter of a wavelength. Bend this downwards 90 degrees. Like so. Now measure half of a wavelength again. And then again a quarter of a wavelength. Take your pliers and bend it towards the bend that you've made before. Now once again, take a random amount on your pliers and bend it upwards, 90 degrees. It should look something like this now. Now measure another quarter of the wavelength. Cut your wire where you've made that measurement. This is what it should look like. Now take any sort of round pipe, whatever you have at home, rolling pin, whatever, and use it to bend this part into a circle. It should look like this. I'll now solder the RG58 to the antenna. Solder the inner to the longer piece and the outer to the shorter piece. You can connect your antenna to your sense cap router by just twisting the female RPSMA to the male RPSMA. But if you would not like to make an antenna like this, we do provide an already made antenna on our store.